Hello and welcome to The Fort Report. I'm Chris Conley. And I'm Alicia Woodruff. Summer is around the corner, so it's time to get in shape. Yes, but this is actually something we should be doing year-round, not just for the beach. That's why Fort Worth Parks and Community Services is offering a free boot camp in March for residents trying to shape up. Participants can choose from two class times at the Greenbrier Community Center. And the best part is, it's free. That's just one free week left, so go check it out. Your nearest community center is always programming new activities for you and your family to enjoy. Want to be part of Fort Worth's efforts to become the safest major city in the country? Well, oh, you can't answer. The City of Fort Worth and the Crime Control and Prevention District have released a request for proposals for the FY 2012 Community-Based Funding Program. The CCPD seeks community-based programs that prevent crime throughout Fort Worth, reduce violent crime and gang-related activity, or decrease juvenile crime. The CCPD Board is especially interested in projects that address youth or family violence. Nonprofit agencies applying for funding can find application forms and instructions at www.fortworthpd.com. Those weren't Fort Worth police officers, were they? No. N no, they weren't. Fortunately, the general public doesn't have to see Chris's bathroom, but that's still no reason for him to leave things out of disrepair. Why are, are we picking on my bathroom? Chris, a dripping faucet here and a running toilet there adds up. Leaks waste 10,000 gallons of water each year in the average home. I know this is news to you, Chris, but fixing a leak is usually as simple as tightening a connection or replacing a washer. So help your city and your water bill by checking the parts of your home that commonly leak. Toilets, faucets, shower heads, and sprinkler systems. And make the repairs. I'm actually pretty handy. And now for something completely different. March is National Kidney Month. Did you know that more than 26 million Americans have chronic kidney disease and most don't know it? Actually, I did. Because kidney disease often doesn't show any symptoms, it can sneak up on people, especially those not aware of the major risk factors. Anyone with high blood pressure, diabetes, or a family history of these conditions or kidney disease is at risk and should get their kidneys checked. Find out more at www.kidney.org. Also, you can get involved by taking part in the National Kidney Foundation Walk. It's this Saturday, March 26th at Trinity Park. Check-in begins at 8 a.m. How will this affect you, Chris? It won't. My kidney feels great. As always, to learn more about these important messages, log on to the city's website at www.fortworthgov.org. I'm Chris Conley. And I'm Alicia Woodruff. Bye. Bye.